Die. Ah, ah. You fucking amateur. You think you can scare us off, huh? We're here. Save your breath, Jace. Come on. Hey, Jace, shut the f right, frick up. Right. Sorry, Mark. You better check that out. But carefully. Ah! Now, you see that chick there? That? That ain't funny. Is that him up there? Hey! Asshole! Let's not scream at him. Oh, mighty. Hey, get away from me. Who said that? Hey, hold their fire! Ah, damn it, we're gears! Maybe they can't hear you! Oh, they can hear me! I said hold your fire, you fucking asshole! Oh boy, I don't like the sound of that! Shit, that's Oh. something to eat.
Yeah, we noticed. <sighs> it's the goddamn car. Yeah, yeah, can we come in? Shit, why are you bringing them up here? Target practice for the cheap. Come on, man. They ain't ordinary car assholes. They just killed a heap of globies for us. They really need to see the cheap. Okay, but only because it's going to be fun watching you kick seven shades of shit out of you, little bitch. I'm an asshole. You are hopeless. You know, I think I heard it. People are just going to step the sword off feet for the coalition. Shut up, Jace. Nobody cares what you know or don't know. Just shut up. I don't want to hear another word from you. I don't want to hear another word out of you until... No, 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 no. Even when we're done with the journey, the mission, I still don't want to hear you talk. So shut up and don't ever talk again. Look, there's his office. Marcus. What did I say? Mr. Griffin, sir, these car guys showed up and they did a great job on the clothes. Now they want some fuel. What the fuck are you doing bringing the cog here into my city? They, 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 they killed the glowings, sir. They, they just want some fuel. Boy, get out of here before I lose my patience. So welcome to Griffin Tower, cog. It was here before you destroyed Char and it's still standing now. And so am I. Got some nerve coming around here asking for favors, motherfuckers. Shut up. Sir, we understand. We just need fuel, and then we'll go. Bitch, you don't understand shit. Whoa. You seen those ash remains? Those were my workforce, my employees, my family. I don't like their rest being disturbed by outsiders, and especially no fucking car. Oh, I think we understand grieving. Oh, who the fuck are you? Marcus Phoenix. Hmm. It is a name I think I recall. You know the first rule of business, Mr. Phoenix? Remind me. It's what's in it for me. You need fuel, so do I. Ironic scene is how I built an empire on it. So you get my fuel back, and I'll let your punk ass keep some. Well, what's stopping you from getting it? Our refinery across the way is a little late with the fuel shipment. Shit, they need to send my cable car back. So I'm asking you to progress the order for me. Get my fuel and my cable car. Now, can you manage that, killer? You wouldn't be setting us up now, would you? Now, get, God damn, get your hands off me! Marcus, they jumped me and took the truck! Every contract has a performance guarantee, Phoenix. Your associate is now mine. Don't you lay a finger on him. Don't you fucking dare. You got it. Dizzy better be okay. That's one of my favorite fucking characters.